Mm. Yeah, we've been living. And walking. Mm-hmm. Got us a cabin. Gotta get to hunting. This might not be us. Hmm. Who's here? I can tell something ain't right about her. And the gun. Yo. Hey, you. Joe. Someone passing through. Take the gun out, two fingers only, put it out of reach. <laughs> like this. <laughs> Why did you shoot him? The gun's all the way over there. <laughs> it hurt me, by the way. Yeah, I got eyes. You made him soup? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking for my brother. Well, I ain't seen him. I haven't told you what he looks like. He look anything like you? A bit. But I ain't seen him. <laughs> a girl with me. Joe, come on, they're like a thousand. He's his little Ooh. psycho. Killed him. Got a map? Why are you lying? Must have missed all the street signs in the enormous fucking forest. Holy! <laughs> <laughs> so you haven't heard the name Tommy? Nope. What about the fireflies? We get those in the summer. Bugs, <laughs> the people. There are firefly people? <laughs> <laughs> Y'all, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We've been out there by ourselves for a while. Guys on the best way west? Yeah. Go east. Mm. To we get west. Go past the river here. Ooh. He knows what he's talking about. What's past the river? Death. We never seen who's out there. Goes down on the west side. Scared him. Mm. Oh, can't you see it? Mm. <laughs> and that's a big dog right there. Mm -hmm. You don't seriously believe him. He's lived here a long time. Oh, oh no. Chest pants? Joel, are you okay? Joel? Shut up. Holy shit, are you dying? Okay, okay. okay. I'm fine. No, no, but are you? Because just a reminder that if you're dead, I'm fucked. Shut up, fine. Oh, he's got anxiety. Altitude, maybe? You take first watch or second? I'll do both. Get some sleep. He's having nightmares. Mm -hmm. Still mumbling in your sleep. I woke up early. You were passed out, so I took second watch. You gotta wake me up if that happens. Mm. You nope. can't do things like this. But I can. Because I just did. <laughs> I'm responsible for you, okay? And don't fall asleep. I looked at tracks, I found the high ground, and I kept watch. Like he taught me to. Mm. Thank you. Say thank you. Wake me up next time. <laughs> <laughs> Never. Mm -mm. <laughs> nope. I feel like I'm about to get sniped. I thought there were some bear traps laid across here or something snaggy your foot. Right. Shut Is that a demon bird? Oh, that's her. You don't know how to whistle. Do you know how to shut the hell up? Does it sound like I know how to whistle? No. Damn. Actually. No Will Livingston. Yeah, yeah, but who is? <laughs> hey, Joel. What if this is the river of death? Oh, mm, she got a bad that first feeling. one, wasn't it? This is the one. Got him paranoid. No! <laughs> On us. Oh, they got horses. Yeah. We're looking for any trouble. We're just passing through. Drop the gun. How about we just talk this through? How about you shut the fuck up? Okay. Easy. You've been near infected? There's no infected out here. The hell there ain't. Mm -hmm. Definitely is. We got a checker. All the dogs can tell. Oh. She is. You good. Now her. Mm. He's confused. He don't want to go near it. You can't tell him. It's getting that death ring. Uh-uh, uh-uh. It's good. We're good. Nice. She had to butter him up, maybe. It's because she's a mix. Just bought yourself ten more seconds. Mm. What are you doing out here? 
Just looking for my brother. It's all, nothing more. Hey. What's your name? Joel. The legend. Oh, she knows Tommy. Oh, they might be fireflies. Dope. An assist. Hmm. They got a clean little fortress out here. For real. I don't know. It could be ugly out here. Man, ain't free. Don't got no Fedra. Could be a town of cannibals. We're not in the clear yet. Tommy! Let's get it. Good vibes. Oh, no. That's not Tommy. Oh, that's Tommy. Is it? That's Sean right. Tommy. Looking healthy. Oh, the black girl knew him. Oh, man. Nice. I'm glad he's still alive. Thank you, sister. So why'd he go off the grid? What the fuck you doing here? Looking for you, nigga. I came here to save you. But you need to save me. <laughs> I'm trying to stay here. <laughs> <laughs> what a relief. Living mm, his best life, bro. No more, though. He should have been tapped in. Got me out there in Boston selling drugs and stuff. You living your best life. We well, ain't got no radio signal over here. In a while since we've had a proper meal. Actually, I don't think I've ever had a proper meal. It's fucking amazing. <laughs> you are buying uh, one credit for a violation uh, of the verbal morality standard. We in the apocalypse. Fuck that. That thing amazing. What? What? Uh, you can't get beat up. What about her manners? <laughs> <laughs> Kids around here don't usually look or talk like you, right? I've been hanging with Joe. Mm. Oh. Talk like me. I want, like, Calm God. down before we get arrested. Also aren't armed. I think maybe y'all got a little off on the wrong foot. Who's gonna have our guys kill us? Well, we gotta be real careful about who we let in this place. We leave dead bodies around? Those are the people who tried us. Ooh. A bad mm. reputation doesn't mean you're bad. Ooh. Not always, at least. She. Mm. Man. She heard about Joe. We're grateful for your hospitality and all. But it'd be nice to have a moment here, maybe just for family. Can we just have a family talk? He's a well, uh, freaking prisoner. He's hidden. Maria is family, actually. That's his wife. Oh shit. Wait. Man, that's his wife. Why you ain't message home? Congrats. <laughs> <laughs> She's the boss too around here. And you said infected? Yeah, but usually smaller colonies. Wandered off from the city. All this open country out here, it's a turkey shoot. Easy money. I still got my 700, but I found a variable power scope. Sub MOA. And headshot those fuckers from a half mile out. Can you teach me how? No, we can't. How do you keep this place quiet? Carefully. Being in the middle of nowhere helps. Not advertising what we have, staying off the radio. Mm. That's why I hit you up. Multi faith. You draw power from a dam. Got that working a couple years ago. Wow. Mm. Plumbing, water heaters, lights. This place actually fucking works. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they turned up. And some sheep. Left his brother out the loop, though. Yeah, it should have been hitting my black car home. Everything you see in our town. Greenhouses, livestock. All shared. Collective ownership. So, uh, communism. Nah. Nah, I didn't like that. It is that. Literally. This is the commune. We're communists. No way. Yeah, Firefly. Well, I'll take Ellie over there if you two want to. Catch up? Yeah, get out the way. Let's talk. <laughs> yeah, okay. Talk to your brother. Yeah. Tommy's scared. <laughs> yeah, he's scared. Harpo out there. My wife is scary, bro. Doesn't seem like you age much. Man, yeah, been stressing. Uh, Thanks for still giving a shit about me. <laughs> Cause you don't care about me. All right. Why ain't you calling? Dead. She's fine. Oh. All right. Good then. Mm. And the kid? She's the daughter of some firefly muckety muck. Trying to find her family somewhere out here. I was heading in this direction, so. Really? Goodness of your heart. I know it's better. Payment. Infected. Raiders. It's not exactly an easy trip. It'll be easy for us. Seeing as how you can headshot infected from half a mile away, which is a bunch of bullshit, by the way. Mm. I know you lie. Yeah, I can't go. Oh, come on. <laughs> I made it across the country. The two of us can make it from here to Colorado. He ain't gone soft. Yeah. They're very protective of this place. 
If a good fucking reason. I mean, folks find out we're up here. No, I heard. Wrong people might show up. Yeah. Is that what I am? I'm the wrong, wrong people. people. Joe, those gonna... things I did, Tommy, those things that you judged me for. I did those things to keep us alive. We did those things. Mm. They weren't things. We murdered people. Mm -hmm. I don't judge you for it. I'm going to be a father. Mm. These are a few months long now. So I just got to be more careful. You still could have hit him up, though. Yeah, he was supposed to at least message him through radio. Because we lost Tess for this mission. Yeah, we did. Trying to get out here to Wyoming to find him. Because we ain't hear from you. All right. And he just so grateful this that... This is his daughter. Oh, that's scary. Yeah. Where's Ellie? What is that? Is that Mastro Solution? Huh? Gross. I think it's a douche? I don't know what it looked like. I just... What is it? Like, type of birth control or <laughs> I don't know, bro. I don't know what I'm looking at. Forgive us our ignorance. We yes, don't know what they're doing. I've never seen that one. <laughs> I've never seen that one. <laughs> Did you get the thing I left you? Yeah. Weirdest gift ever. Thanks, boy. Who's been cutting your hair? Uh, world class salons. <laughs> Let me get my scissors. Oh, whoa, no. I'll... Trim. No. That's all. Just the ends. I promise. She is overstepping her boundaries. You don't need to cut my hair, though. You tripper. You were looking at the little memorial Tommy made? Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm sorry about your kids. It's okay. My kid. She's Kevin. Sarah was Joel's daughter. Mm. Oh, she didn't know that. Mm. I guess we could explain some a little. We stopped killing people. Innocent ones. And Tommy did it too. Are you worried about him? Oh, you didn't know that? Of course you do. Tommy was following Joel. Ooh. Yeah, well, maybe I'm smart than Tommy. No offense. Uh. Well, definitely smart. Be careful who you put your faith in. The only people who can betray us are the ones we trust. Facts. So you let me off the hook or what? That's right. Did the university get a suicide mission? Yeah. No. no it's dangerous, but nothing you can't handle. Oh. Just prepare and do what you do. We've had people go that way and come back. I mean, all of them. I mean, what is this? It's Worried about Ellie. Oh, he told him. What? Ellie. She got infected, but she didn't get sick. Don't you tell nobody. Tommy. I saw her get bit myself. That was months ago. Months. It's getting him horny. He yeah. can't leave now. <laughs> Bring back the time. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I didn't want to tell him. He's got to hear it all. About to tell him about Tess. Age is getting the best of them. No matter who I was. I'm weak. Damn. Fresher legs. Moments where fear comes up out of nowhere. My heart. Feels like it stopped. You want me to take her? I'm just going to get her killed. I know it. I know it. I mean, it's why you took off on me, right? To make up for the things we did. Oh. Well, here's your chance to bring your kid into a better world. You're younger than me. You're still strong. You said it yourself. You'll come back. You have to take her. Mm. No pressure. That is why he left. To be a firefly to change the world. I'll take her out at dawn. Mm. By yourself? Listen. Uh, why are you here? I came here to talk to you. No way. You're still here. You're going to ditch me. Ditch me. Oh, she heard him? She was listening in. What exactly did you hear? Mm. I have to leave her. You have to take her. She knows the area better than I do. Do you right? give a shit about me or not? Of course I do. Then what are you so afraid of? Losing you. Losing you. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm not your daughter. Mm. Maria told me about Sarah. And... No. <clears throat> Don't say another word. I'm sorry about your daughter. 
but I have less people too. You have no idea what loss is. Shut up. Don't say that. Everybody I have cared for has either died or left me. Everybody fucking except for you. So don't tell me that I'd be safe with somebody else because the truth is I would just be more scared. Mm. Mm. You gotta go, Joe. You're not my daughter. I'm not sure as hell ain't your dad. No, oh, well, you're nothing. No, come down. Go on with Tommy. We're going our separate ways. Damn. He didn't mean that. He tired. We done crossed most of the country together. I done got you this far now. Come on, Tommy. Finish the job for me. What if they continue to show with Tommy and her? That's crazy. That would be crazy. I feel safer with Joel. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Tommy's looking young and healthy. Oh yeah, he's coming too. You came here to say goodbye or something? No. I came here to steal one of these horses and go. Which uh would have gave you one? Oh, I don't know. I'm tagging along. You deserve a choice. I still think you'd be better off with Tommy. Let's go. <laughs> say less, bro. Well turn up then. Never mind, Thomas. We still need your guidance, your gun. Oh, you're talking about him coming along? Yeah, he may know somebody that's up there, too. What if he comes out here and dies and he's got a kid on the way? Yeah, that's bad. <laughs> but Tommy ain't going. <laughs> yeah, he ain't going, yeah. Both of you. Count it on it. For real. Let me borrow that rifle. Can I borrow that? <laughs> right. <laughs> For real. Maria took mine. Yeah. He said yes, Joel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I thought he was gonna ignite that firefly in him, but nah. Mm -mm. Maria got that wet wet. <laughs> you listen. Ride right. You're flinching. The target's too small. I made it bigger than it should have. Eject the cartridge. Rifle just sucks. Okay, give it. You squeeze the trigger like you love it. Mm. Gentle, steady, nice and slow. You gonna shoot this thing or get it pregnant? <laughs> Both. It isn't gonna work. It doesn't aim right. You say it. Damn. You... He's him. <laughs> Hemi Johns. 100% accuracy. <laughs> Absolutely. I ain't bought. How about that? Made it in five days. Easy days. I don't know what Tommy was so afraid of. Stop. Why would you say that? Mm, this is looking bad. What does that mean? Oh, we there. We're at the university. Perfect. Yeah. They ain't here no more. Bad it too. Yeah. It they were here in the university. There's a packing list. Something to make before moving. That's your thing, what? All the things we there. Maybe getting ahead of the weather. What, Utah? I don't know. No guns. At the back. They looking for us? They know we're here? Of course. Ugh. She ready. Mm -hmm. uh, he he's still Joe. Go to sleep, buddy. Mm -hmm. uh. yeah, you know what's up. <gasps> oh, he got shanked. Joe. He ain't even feel it. Oh, no. Dang. Yeah, y'all gotta go. Yeah, cause y'all ain't got nothing. Uh, Stop bucking, girl. Save some bullets. Bleeding out. Oh. He ain't dead, is he? Ain't no way. He was what? He didn't go with Tommy anyway, because he had a feeling he was not going to make it through, bro. Ain't no way. Oh, hold on. Is there some end credit? They're not showing us everything. Hold on. I don't want to get a spoiler. What do you mean they're not showing us everything? They show him pass out, fall off the horse, going pale. Maybe just let him nap. He need a Zoro moment. One of them Zoro naps and 
bleed now. This is a very real world out here. Nah, see? See? Nah. Because Bill got shot and Frank put him on the table. He was bleeding out. It looked like he was dead too. Frank got all kinds of stuff. That was just recent though. You know what I'm saying? It was like he passed out for a moment and the, with the heat of the bullet still in him. He, he knows some aid. Yeah, he, he said he had some there. first aid or whatever, but he was fading off into them crossroads and passed out. Frank and Frank started holding on to him. <laughs> Bill. He knew the first rules. Compress the blood, make sure he don't leak no more. I'm saying the way that they played it off, they made it seem like Bill died right there on the table. Here, it was kind of subtle and then it just, you know, panned away and that sad music started playing and now I'm conflicted. He's dead, dead. We lost Joe. Dang. That's wild. I mean, Dang. that's hard to believe, right? What is she gonna do for real? Well, fortunately, she knows how to hunt and everything and well, she's still not the best shot. We just... They've been talking about it like all episode. Dude was saying, I, I, all I know is that I'm losing something and I'm failing. He's probably having nightmares about like the day that he dies and fails to protect Ellie or something. You know what I'm saying? Ellie probably getting shot in his dreams. Ellie's probably getting taken away from him as he gets restrained somehow. From losing a step, losing a fight or something. Yeah, he done developed a soft spot for Ellie. Not only that, he was stressing about his brother. He didn't know if his brother was alive or safe. So Joe went out of his way to get a battery. He's selling drugs. He's doing all kinds of things to get a battery. And been traveling with Ellie. He's taking on burden after burden. And turns out your brother is living his best life the whole time. If he wasn't so pressed to go to Wyoming, him and Tess would have never gotten a car to drive Ellie out. There's no need to get a battery because I have no need to go to Wyoming. Because right. my brother's good. So we left the Boston QZ to get to Tommy and I got on a whole nother mission in the process to now he's got somebody like a daughter to him he doesn't want to lose. I felt for Joe. Yeah, like I understood that feeling, you know what I'm saying? Joe can't catch a break. I guess that's the consequences of the life he lived. I'm hoping we had a sad exit away screening like that only to come back next episode and she got him in some cabin patched up Yeah. with some medical up. tape on his abs. Yeah. Maybe she can do it. Hopefully he's still alive, but uh, I just don't know how she's getting his body back on that horse in the snow. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just don't see her having the strength to pick up Joe, lift him above her head to the horse. It looked like there were some uh cabins around. Oh, that's still the university. Oh, hold on. Yeah, maybe there's a first aid kit over that there. That cabin. <laughs> that's the magical cabin right now, little red cabin. That's the cabin, bro. Yeah. You gotta drag him to the cabin. Yeah, there you go. Okay. It's one of those. It's a first first aid kit in there, maybe. That'd be great. Dang. I won't get my hopes up because it's a cruel world we live in. We lose friends all the time. Every episode, we lose somebody. It is the apocalypse. Every episode, man. It could have kept alive Sam. Dope episode. Looking forward to the next. I'll let you boys rock. <laughs> The source of my name and the difference between us is scale is so vividly obvious while in the studio I become uber and then I start treating the beat like the mafia you yeah. think the nearest just holler jacottas cause fire is proceeding from haters esophagus me and my partners are represent Charlotte the city that's North Carolina's metropolis and we've been patiently waiting to display our greatness showcasing our lyrical dominance and it be